Sherry and Toffee. Welcome to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet. My name is Lüning, Horst Lüning, I'm the master taster of whiskey.com and today we have a new bottle, Glen Moray, 15 years old, 40% ABV and roughly below 50 euros, dollars, pounds. This whiskey is part of the Glen, of the Elgin heritage. Elgin, what's that here? Elgin heritage. What's that? Elgin is the, well, the local uh, administration town of that area. It's not too big, well, but it's one of the biggest towns there in the space side. Um, there are some Glen Morays in the market, uh, 12 years old, uh, wine finished, a 16 years old had been on the market for quite a time, very old ones were seen as well. But uh, Glen, Elgin, uh, Glen Moray had problems um, in their group of distilleries uh, to show through. They had two uh, other distilleries in the group, Artbeck and Glen Morangie. So Glen Moray was always the cheap one, the unwanted, the black swan. Uh, and then they were sold because the, I think, uh, the margins were not that, not that good as with other distilleries uh, and uh, they sold it to, I think, a French company, La Martinique, I think. And with this new uh, proprietors, uh, Glenmore has the chance to, to grow and to show what they really can. Uh, the Glen Moray distillery has been producing single malt scotch whiskey since the 19th century, uh, roughly, 1879, uh, 97, 1897. The capital of Speyside, Elgin, the capital of Speyside, Scotland's most famous whiskey region. Glen Moray, 15 years old, single malt whiskey combines the sweet vanilla flavors from American oak cask with a rich dried fruit and dark chocolate characteristic derived from Spanish sherry cask. The result is an exquisitely rich and balanced whiskey. And uh, this is no finishing. This is a mixture of two kinds of casks, each maturing for 15 years. So this is a kind of blending process inside a single distillery. So still a single malt whiskey. Color, copper? No. Dark gold. Nose, sherried oak, butter, toffee, and delicate sm smoke. Where do they get smoke from? I never had a Glenmorry with a little smoke, no? Taste, full-bodied and moorishly sweet. Imagine a spiced dark chocolate alongside a finely oaked wine, intense and satisfying. Yeah, finish long and rich, the spice intensifies as the sweetness fades. Yeah. Not too intense on the cork. I like this uh, shaped bottle, which looks like uh, the neck of a pot still. And this brings this gluck, 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 uh, whenever you pour the whiskey out. Sherry and toffee. A lot of both. And, well, a little smokiness in the back. Where does that come from? Have they produced smoky whiskey in the past or did they use uh, old art bag casks where they left two or three liters in the cask after uh, disgorging? Hmm, no idea. A little smokiness. Wow, this brings complexity in the whiskey. So sherry, toffee, and a little smokiness. Full, intense, and vanilla showing through. A wonderful, intense, sherry matured whiskey. Mm. 
Mm. Full in the mouth. Sweetness showing through. Oh, uh -huh. second gulp. Mouth watering a lot. Mm. A little oakiness. Winey notes. This, well, probably this brick uh, matured wine. Yeah. Showing a little chocolate, but only a very few. Long and good spicy, mellow spicy, mellow spicy. Yeah, not that sharp spiciness, but a welcoming mellow spiciness oh, with some sweet accents in the past and in the back. There are some other matured Glenmorris on the market. They're the 12 years old. I think it's a, it's a, is it a Chardonnay finish? I think, yes, or Chardonnay, matured whiskey. And uh, an 18 years old is on the market. I think those three together give this Elgin Heritage Collection. And without those big brothers in the company tree, uh, the Glenmorris is able to shine, to really develop to show what they are able to. <sighs> mm. Ah, the more I have of this one, the better it becomes, really. A wonderful piece of work and reasonably priced for a new whiskey with 15 years old, less than 50. This is a bargain. So whenever you see distilleries, which, well, hadn't had the focus on from the proprietors, there are gems to dig up, to show to the public. Wonderful piece of work. Well, this has potential. Thank you very much for thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned and feel free to share this video with your friends and give your comments in our whiskey database on whiskey.